Uh, Marilyn backstage and I'm so pleased to, uh, to be here for a leader conversation with, I can't repeat your name, it's so difficult for me. You can either call me Avshalom, Avshalom. or Father of Peace, which okay. is the translation of my name. First things, I have to say that you are absolutely amazing as a designer and as an artist because your the power of the colors and the path of your fashion show is really vibrant. I saw the best um, assembly, uh, the couleur, uh, colors, absolutely um, vibrant. And I want to know from you which was the main challenge to assemble all these colors this year for this collection? Well, first of all, I have to thank you for all the compliments. Uh, it's good I have a lot of makeup so nobody can see that I'm blushing. <laughs> but uh, thank you, really, thank you so much. Um, I think when you create a collection, it's really like um, layer after layer. So first you just get the inspiration and you choose the fabric and you work on the print individually, like different children. And once you have all the family, then you mix them together and you check what works and what doesn't work. It's not something that happened in a day, it's a process. Yeah. And, uh, and, and I think this is, uh, that's the fun of it, that in today this was the first time I saw it all together. And that's the big day we all, myself and my team of designers, stylists, hairstylists, makeup artists, merchandisers, uh, you know, company CEO, all that big organization we have. Um, working towards today and what do you think you were the the, the skills you have that uh, help you uh, the most in having this kind of success in pushing pushing you forward in this job well I think experience yeah is the okay. most uh, essential yeah. skill um, I didn't have it when I just graduated St. Martin's. Yeah. I did a lot of jobs. I was uh, hired by many people. I was fired by many people. I had my own no, label. Can't believe it. And, uh, and I've done a lot of mistakes. And I've learned from those mistakes. Uh, but the most important thing is that I listen to my heart. And I'm very connected to art. And I take inspiration from art and artists. And uh, I look inside rather than looking outside. So if you put all of this together, hopefully you can be um, strong and you can have a vision in today's world which has so many um, root of uh, communication that if you try to listen to what comes from the outside, you just get confused. So you just work from what you want to do. How do you see yourself in uh, five years time, uh, not only yourself and Marilyn Brand as well? Well, you know, for me, uh, Marilyn is, uh, is really a true love because it's something that started very small for me uh, eight years ago. Um, and uh, it comes with great vision of our management. When you find the right partner in life and in business, mm. I definitely see myself working for, always working for Marilyn and with Marilyn and leading the Marilyn team. We're like a big family. So I would like to see more Marilyn shops worldwide. I'd like to see bigger collections. And uh, for me, it's just to do it, to continue to do what I love doing with the people I love doing. Um, and I don't think I can ask for more. That would be very greedy. Okay, so thank you so much for this uh, conversation. See you next season and uh, very good luck uh, for your future collection. Uh, thank you for having me here in the backstage. Thank you so much and please make sure you come to the next show. Yeah, so stay tuned on the Italian way. Simona Cocchi, Hash. Absolutely. Okay. Bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Thank you.